and Morgan Webb. Welcome to X Play. Welcome, welcome, excitement, yay, yay excitement, woo. yay. We have Mega Man. We have a first-person shooter, and it's based on one of the most popular tabletop RPGs out there. We also have golf. Mm, golf, but first, Adam has a game based on cute collectible toys. Now, is it a My Little Pony first-person shooter? It's like mini. No, no, it's, it's no. like a whack a mon chi oh. No, it's not. Oh, no, a girl can dream, but I don't know. yeah, she can dream, but she should dream bigger than that. Oh. I've always hoped for a Smurf dating sim myself, you know, but. Then I thought about it. you only have Smurf fat out there, so the Smurfing options are right. limited. Let's get back to the point. Yes, fast. Yes. We have a game about muscles. Yeah, and muscles is an acronym for millions of unusual small creatures lurking everywhere. That's what it is, which is how I describe our interns. And it's, it's a very small effective creatures. way of doing that, muscles. Here's our review of Ultimate Muscle. That muscle has its own zip code. I know. Dick, dick. I, 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 I can't get tired of saying that. Dick, dick. Never. Dick, dick. Dick, dick. Mm, right. Ultimate muscle, you know, it has a couple of odd features. Uh, yeah, there. and I think we'd like to share it with the nice people at home. Okay, now get this. Dick, dick. When you load the game, you always see like one Russell pop up. He'll tell a, a tale or something, uh -huh. or sometimes he'll sing you a song. A horrible song. Now, in this clip, Kid Muscle does a musical number. We call this the cow song. It's very, very catchy. Wow. It's really something. Hmm, that is just weird. It yeah, weird. And it's probably going to catch on. It is a little catchy. I'm going to be humming it later. And I do like beef as much as the next person. You do. It never occurred to me to sing a song about it. Mm, cow. Mm. Cow. See, I'm doing that. All right, let's just get out of that and move on to a game yeah, good idea. starring an icon who's been starred in more games than any other character. And that character's name is Mega. Man. Now, before you guys go get your panties in a little bunch, we know Mario appears in more games than anyone else, but Mega Man stars in more. And now he's starring, starring. as a star in a brand new game. Here's our review of Mega Man Network Transmission. I wear boxers. Oh, you got so mad at that game. I thought you were going to have an aneurysm. That vein in your forehead, it was... Poppin'. And it's just my one vein. I, I don't have. That's why <laughs> things are so slow for me. I hate Mega Man Network Transmission. The game has hurt my pride and oh. it hurt my ultimate gaming muscle. Oh, say your happy words, Adam. Your happy words. Tick, tick. Tick, tick. Tick, tick. Yeah. Adam Sessler and Morgan Webb. Welcome back to X Play. You're the pink, right? Ugh, I was going to try to claim blue first. <laughs> We have a first-person shooter based on War... That's so unfair. Warhammer 40,000. Now, for those of you out there who don't know, Warhammer 40,000 is an RPG set in the 41st millennium. That's like 38,000 years from now. Yeah, and we'll all be really old by then. Or possibly dead. Now, most of the previous Warhammer games, like Chaos Gate and Rites of War, were, of course, strategy games. Now, today, we're going to be taking a sneak peek at Fire Warrior. This is the first attempt at Warhammer 40K, that's the short way of saying it, it's now going to be a first-person shooter, and it's developed by the London-based Kuju Games. They're most famous for the Microsoft Train Simulator. That sounds like a match made in heaven, like peanut butter and wine. Yeah. Here's a preview of Warhammer 40,000 Fire Warrior. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. you tell them. Yeah. Fire Warrior is going to be out for me and all you other disgruntled people out there for the PS2 and the PC later this year. And if you'd like to read our entire preview, there's so much more, come visit our website. And that's at techtv.com slash xplay. I still good. know it. Now there, you can also sign up for our newsletter. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a newsletter. Uh, you think they would give us that. In it, you can find out what's coming up for the week. And you can also get cheats, reviews, and a message from Morgan or me. Yes, like... Drink your oval team. And you don't even need a secret decoder ring, but it looks good. Coverage until we were sued by Fox News. Welcome back. We have an action RPG, action RPG mm. that takes place in the EverQuest universe. That's made by the same people who made Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance, and it uses the same formula. Take a hardcore RPG and make an action hack and slash out of it. Here's a preview of Champions of Norath. Norath? Wow. Seeing Schwarzenegger in this preview, I guess I'm so excited for the Terminator 3 game, because that way you might be able to kill people with the governor. Mm. Now we need to get the people behind Ultimate Muscle to make a recall SmackDown game. And you know Gray Davis' finishing move? 
the rolling blackout. Oh, yeah. So I want to play as Cruz Bustamante because his name is Cruz Bustamante. And we turned into C-SPAN. Go to break before you lose all of the viewers. Play. Guess what? We're back. And we have golf. Dick, dick golf? No, just, just toadstool golf. Which sounds sort of like a hippie thing. Yeah, it does. Oh, well, you don't know. Nintendo's branching out, and they're going to have a whole new hippie line of games. We have oh. Patchouli Racer 2004. Mm. The other one I'm looking forward to is the uh, it's the tour with fish on your daddy's trust fund sim. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought Trailer Park Tycoon was a bad idea. but that's well, No, that's a bad idea. These are just worse ideas. There, oh. There's a lot of room to work in there. Right. Okay, and as you all know, Mario's been branching out and doing like some of the sporty things. Crazy Mario. Yeah, he's playing tennis. Mm -hmm. He's been playing golf. Uh, we also know that he's been racing in Mario Party. Kart. And if you consider fighting to be a sport, which I do, he's been fighting in Super Smash Brothers Melee. Mm, I don't know. Hopefully there'll never be a Mario deer hunter. And by that, I do mean Mario going to Vietnam. Think about that. Mario sitting there playing Russian roulette, looking all stern. How I cute. like that idea. Nintendo, do that for me now. Anyway, we're out to see the newest, or the review of the newest golfing outing for Mario. Yes, it's called Mario Golf Toadstool Tour. That plant did a Technicolor yawn. Yes, Blah. puking games. We need more of that. Yeah. Okay, well, if you want to see the full review of yes. Mario Golf Toadstool, Toadstool Tour, Get it right. you can find it on our website. TechTV.com slash xplay. There's other good stuff there. Yes, xplay extras, Adam Sulking, that kind of good stuff. Dick, dick. Mwah. Dick, dick. Good night. Dick, dick. Thanks. Yay.